Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Rest World. Uh, we've got another quarterfinal game today. It's um, North London Wanderers versus Underdogs FC. Um, they're both in the same league, so I'll put the league table here. Uh, North London Wanderers are fighting for promotion, um, but North London Colts have a lot of games in hand against them. And Underdogs, unfortunately, I think have been relegated already. So um, they don't have a lot to play for in the league. Um, so the Cups are what they're playing for. So this is a quarterfinal. Uh, they've played twice before, I believe, uh, just in the league. And uh, it's not gone well for underdogs. It's been, I think, 6-1 both times to North London Wanderers. So um, I know underdogs are going to be up for it, but how much they can um, keep North London Wanderers out, I don't know. But it should be an interesting game. Uh, we'll see if North London Wanderers uh, do the same as they have the last two games. Uh, so excited for this one. Uh, hopefully they both agree to uh, having one person run the line as well so last couple of games someone has run the line which has been great a lot easier for me and uh, also i've updated my watch so we're finally using the rest six app again so what this does is just records like my running so this was last week's game i'll put it right here uh, i ran over 11 kilometers so yeah i'm super fit at the moment so yeah over 11k um, we're going to keep using this so that was in the Continental v uh, AFC Muswell Hill again, all in the same league. Uh, a, another quarterfinal game, which Continental won three 0 So uh, just gonna make our way to the ground now. Obviously, a quick pitch inspection. Uh, say hello to the managers. But uh, the pitches should be nice. It's been sunny all week. Uh, it's quite cold today, as it would be on game day. Uh, but still excited to ref this one. So uh, we'll see you at the ground. So this is the pitch. Uh, you can see them setting up the nets as most teams do in Sunday League. Quite a decent sized pitch for a Sunday League game. Uh, that's underdogs over there warming up. Uh, that is North London Wanderers. So underdogs are up for it. Yeah, so uh, underdogs are up for it. Um, so I'm just walking around, checking the stuff. I'm about to get set up now, do a little warm up, have a talk with the captains. And then uh, first half begins. So. Uh, Got about 25 minutes. We'll see you uh, at half time. Hey, yes, yes, little push. Your arm was up here, pushing the back. Of course, you're going to use your hands. You can't do that. No, mate, he's put his leg. He's put his leg out, mate. You've gone in. You've gone in, man. You've gone in like that. You've missed the ball. You've gone in and missed the ball. He's gone in and missed the ball completely, man. Yeah, as, yeah. If he's clipped him, it's a pen. Thank you. If he's clipped him. If he's clipped him, it's a pen then. Thank you. And it's an early penalty to North London Wanderers. Uh, you heard the centre-back say at the end there that the keeper did clip him, but he did fall down a bit late. So let's take another look at this one. Uh, the pitch was very bobbly, so uh, keepers mishandled it there. It goes to get the ball, and uh, has he clipped the striker there on the back of the hill? Striker falls down. He's got the penalty, so it's a penalty to NLW. Let's take uh, one more look at this. Here we go. So Cuba's just fumbled it there. Uh, striker gets his foot to it there. And um, I've given a penalty. Let me know what you would have given. Man, yes, you saw the ball got the shot and he's taking him out. He's late. Yes, no, man, you heard him as well. Look, 100%. No, 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 because he's kicked in, that's why. On the spot, on the spot. Got to be touching, yeah? Got to be touching. And it's a penalty this time for underdogs. So you see a ball played over the top here. Great ball, great chest there by the 14. And you see he's just clipped there on the back of his foot. Uh, let's take one more look at it. Normally these aren't given in the box, but I believe it did affect the shot. Uh, he knew the players there couldn't really get a full extension on the kick. And it's a penalty to underdogs. Just hold it. Yeah! 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 
Guys, just carry on, man. Ten, ten. Don't answer it. I'll go as you get. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. Ten, come over. Ten. Let's go. No attempt to play the ball. He's just kicked the back of his legs. No, you're not. Name. 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 How are you giving a name? First one. Name. How are you giving a name? What's the reason? Because you played no attempt to play the ball. And you just kicked this hill. Okay. Name. I was running. Name. It's not poor. You made no attempt to play the ball. No, right, it's right, it's what was poor? Was that challenge? Cool, cool, cool. Oh, heads up, heads up. Let me see, ref. Let's go. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. Look, thank you. Your player, your player said it was. Your player said it was. <laughs> it's easy when your own player said it. Yes, yeah, yes. The intent, man. The intent. Move away. Yes. Think. I know about the intent. If everyone can slide and miss, yeah, yeah, then move away, move away. Move away from me. Move away from me. Move away from me. Don't talk to me like that, man. Running at me like that. What do you mean, bro? Run at me. You run at me. Shut up, man. No, don't talk to me. You run at me. You run at me. What happened? Huh? He's fouled him. He's clipped him. He hasn't touched the ball. Yes, you did, man. Move away. Yes, mate. Got a bit heated there. Let's take another look at it. Does the 14 get his foot to the ball first? You can see toe pokes it that way. If the orange did touch it, the ball would have gone the other way. And look, who's running to who first? You can see him take some steps. I take two steps and I'm just standing up for myself. You hear it all the time, refs get abused. I'm just not going to have it from this player. Should have been booked as well. And that's the halftime whistle. NLW go into the halftime 1-0 up in this quarterfinal clash. Two penalties were given in that first half. Uh, let me know what you think about both of them. Uh, for me, still both penalties looking back at it. Uh, the centre-back even admitted that the keeper clipped him. It was just a delayed fall. And the second one, he just got his foot to it first and then he was kicked by the centre-back. Centre-back didn't really say anything. Keeper didn't say too much either. But one penalty scored, uh, one penalty missed. And uh, yeah, it's been a really close game. Uh, underdogs were well up for this. You saw just before kickoff, uh, they were warming up. They were there way before me as well uh, so uh, they've not got a lot to play for so this is the only competition that they're in and uh, you can tell that they want to win it i hope you enjoyed that first half and uh, we'll see you at full time <laughs> You okay? I can see that though. You okay? Yeah. 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 Move away. Move away. Um, let me make sure you're playing that. Right, that's it. Yeah. Do you want to treat me or are you good? Yeah, 14, come over. I didn't even see the man. Hey, I weren't even looking at the man. You okay? Let's take another look at that one. A uh, bit reckless. Yeah, high foot. Uh, let me know if you would have given a red card there. Just didn't know the player was there at all. Hey, no, no, you didn't go in anyway. You didn't even catch it. Yeah, yeah, two hands on it. Oh, man, ref! Bro! He didn't touch the ball. Man. You didn't touch that the ball though. So you didn't touch the ball though. The whole ball. You didn't touch the ball. I've got the f***ing ball. On the D. Okay, we're here. Yeah, right on the line. The right back will certainly touch the ball. Is it a foul here? Let's take another look as we zoom in. He gets none of the ball. The 18 clearly gets to it and he's fouled. It's a free kick to underdogs. Um, I don't see how he even felt that he touched the ball. One more look. Yeah, it's definitely a free kick to underdogs. What a free kick that was. Uh, underdogs level. Let's take another look. That's top corner there. Great free kick. And they're back in the game. Just come over. 
First or second or third is a trip and they're on the attack there. And that's the full-time whistle. It finishes 1-1. And uh, in the quarterfinal stage, there's no extra time. So we're straight to penalties. Our first penalty shootout. Uh, this is going to be good. Um, the free kick that was given. Definitely a free kick. And an underdog scored from it. Great free kick. There wasn't really a lot to show in that second half. Uh, both teams are just wanting to play football. And I feel like I've controlled the game really well. few yellow cards in the game. Um, just calmed it down every time I gave a booking. So, uh, yeah, it's been a really good game of football. And uh, I'm not going to speak during the penalties. I'm going to let you enjoy it. And, yes, enjoy our first penalty shootout. And it's our first penalty shootout. Uh, we chose this side because the other side had a slight dip in the penalty spot. So it was hard to keep the ball still. That's the side that underdogs missed on. Uh, spoke to both keepers. You don't see the other keeper in this shot, but he was really close. Uh, one foot on the line. It's best of five. So best score after five penalties is the winner. If it's a draw, we go to sudden death. Let's get into the penalty shootout. I just want to quickly point out after that last penalty miss, the ball was lost in the bushes over there, so the ball was changed. And that's the full-time whistle after the penalties. And underdogs are your winners. 4-3 uh, after sudden death. So uh, NLW had a chance to win it there at the end. And the keeper pulled off a great save. And uh, let me just say, both keepers had great games. But the underdog's keeper, after his mistake, which led to the penalty, was amazing. You don't see it in the video because we talk about the decisions. But he pulled off some worldy saves that kept him in the game. Uh, I think if it wasn't for him... NLW would have won this uh, three or four, maybe even five one, but he had a great game. And yeah, underdogs win. I hope you enjoyed this week's match on Refs World. I uh, hope you enjoyed the decisions. Let me know what you thought about my performance and we'll see you next week for another episode of Refs World.